Farmingville is about the making of America. We go through this every time a new group comes in. It was the same with the Irish, it was the Italians, the Jews, anybody who came in, it was the same thing. We don't want you here. This is our country. But this is a country of immigrants. So how can we close the door on those coming behind us? We didn't want to preach to the converted on any side. We wanted people to come in and be able to experience what it was like to be a man who had left his family, who had crossed the desert, and was now standing on a corner trying to find work so he could send men money home. We wanted people to be able to feel what it would be like if they had a group of men, 30 men, move into a house right next door to them. It, you know, this is their American dream. They've bought their home. How would I feel? And then we also wanted to allow the people who were trying to make decisions for the, for the community to have a say. What is it like when you can't do anything for your community because your hands are tied? What, what is it, how is the trickle down, you know, from the government not allowing us to move forward in any direction because our immigration policy really needs to be, to be changed? I think for me one of the greatest surprises uh, um, that came out of this film was the amount and the depth of hate that there is out there already against Latinos. Call me naive. I didn't expect that uh, there were groups out there that um, are walking around thinking that we're out to reconquer the United States. Um, I didn't realize that there were people out there who were willing to say, who stand up in town meetings and say, Latinos are genetically incapable of assimilating, um, which is something that I heard at a town meeting in East Hampton. Um, that level of hate existing already um, surprised me. I don't think extremes at either side are going to change as a result of this film. That, that's a given. But our hope is that maybe somewhere along the way, people who are grappling with, this, with these issues, because it's, it's a very difficult issue. We're talking about change. We're talking about things like fundamental values such as my suburban ideal is being jeopardized right now. What am I going to do about that? How do you respond to that? And our hope is that, my hope is that this film, in its own small way, by showing a variety of responses, by showing the consequences of certain responses, will lead people to look at themselves, look into themselves, and come out with what I hope will be a constructive and positive approach to this issue when they, when they face it.